Sophie from Crazy Maze of Creations. How are you? I am super excited. Yay! So come on in. Today we are kicking off the Clubby Live Marathon. I'm so excited. It's going to be a two-day event. And we have a great lineup for you guys this weekend. So one of my clubbies, Tom Hutton from Tweety's Tom's Creations. Um, we were in my private group on Sunday at Fun Day Bo Sunday. And he was like, hey, do we need to do something for the community? We should just do it like a marathon of lives. And I was like, that is a fabulous idea. Um, we need to do it. I said, don't worry, I'll get it going. So I put a post in my private group. We had an abundance of people sign up for it. So instead of it being a one-day event, it is a two-day event. So I am super excited about it. So the premise of it is, because all moms and dads are home with their kids, and I'm sure they're ready to pull their hair out. I'm just trying to look for the live. Um, here we go. Oh, volume. No bueno. There we go. Um, come on and say hello when you see the live. Um, so, um, so moms and dads are home, going crazy with their kid kiddos. So we decided to do something for the community. So we're going to do a live every hour. We will have a new designer on here, um, filling you with, to inspire you, to get your creative juices flowing. Just to, hey guys, hey Ty, to all my clubbies, how are ya? Hey Stephanie, um, just to get you inspired. Or just if, you know, if you're bored, if you have the kids, you're like, I can't take any more kids, get in your room. And you will need an hour just to decompress and just zen. We're here to bring that to you, just to entertain you and uh, bring you some pretty things. So just sit back. You have eight hours today of us, so from 12 to 8. If you want to find the schedule, it is posted on Crazy Maisie Creation in the community page and on my page, and all my clubbies have shared it also. You will see the schedule, what time, who goes on when, and all you have to do is go on their page. So after me, 1 o'clock, is Paula Schneider from PSEN Creations. You're going to go to PSEN Creations, click on it, and you're going to, up, you're going to see her live right after me at 1 o'clock. So it's going to be fabulous. It is going to be a fun, fun day. So you won't be bored, guys, all right? We are going to inspire you, and before you know, you're going to want to create things on your own and be like, you know what? I can do that. That's what we're here for. All right, so let's get started because we only have one hour, okay? So I'm going to read comments, um, but I'm not going to read them like I typically, typically do, okay? Because I only have an hour, and anyone who knows me knows that I like to chit-chat. And if I start chit-chatting, you know I could go on for two or three hours. So, I need you guys to do three things for me. Have a good time, engage, talk to each other, meet new friends, and spread the love. That's it. That's all you ever have to do on my live, and I'm going to give away some happy mail because Doodles and I want to give back to our community, and we do that. Hey, Ann Nichols, to all my clubbies, um, and the way we do that is by you guys spreading the love for us, and we send you happy mail. That's it. It's that simple. So, let's get started. Today, we're going to do a grapevine, okay? I'm doing an Easter grapevine because um, I love Easter and I'm still kind of into it. So there has to be that one person out there that doesn't have an Easter wreath on their door after St. Patty's Day. Well, here, I'm here to tell you, and it's not going to scream Easter. It's going to scream spring. It's going to scream, um, um, I don't know what it's going to scream. It's just going to, my head is just swarming today with all the marathon happiness going on. Hey, sweet Connie McCormick. Hey, Tammy Denton. Um, it's going to just scream just sunshine and flowers and goodness, okay? So we're going to get our sign on first. This sign is in my shop at Crazy Maisie Creations if you want to go check it out. We have added round um, signs to our arsenal in our shop. And Doodles is cutting them out, and I'm loving them. Thank you for sprinkling the love, guys. I do appreciate it. Um, so we're just going to get this on there. And I don't work. Hey, Amanda. How are you? Hey, Jacqueline. Thank you so much. Hey, Katrina. Hey, Joanne. We had our clubby Zoom call last night, and it was so much fun, guys. We have a Zoom call once a month in my private design group. And I'm telling you, we were on for four hours. We talked to business. We talked husbands. We, t we talked everything under the sun. Hand cream. But it was good. It was really, really a good, good time last night. So I'm just getting this sign on here nice and tight, okay? 
And if you are interested in finding um, a design group to join, you can always join Katie's Clubhouse. That is my private design group. Um, we have a great time in there. Um, and the link is in the comments. Now, I have not spread the love for myself today only because... Like I said, I design. It's I like to chit chat, you know, and um, I didn't want to take the time away from. We have to be on a schedule. Everyone's live has to be an hour, you know, for today, and we have to keep the schedule because we have a full day of designing going on. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Hey Willie, how are you? Hey Tiffany, how are you, sweet thing? So I hope you guys enjoy this. The Zoom call was great last night. It was right, Ty. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed today. I hope if your kids are driving you crazy or you're just bored being home with everything going on in the world, you just turn on Facebook and you will see one of my clubbies live all day today up until 8 o'clock. So like I said, if, if you want to see the schedule, the schedule, so we have the sign on, really cute, right? Um, so um, if you want to see the schedule, it's posted in Crazy Maisy Creations. Um, it's posted on my page. It's posted in the community page. And we also will start a live tomorrow as well. It's a two-day event, like I said, because a lot of clubbies wanted to get involved and be a part of this. And I thought it was a great idea. All right, so let's get some greenery going. We're going to put the sign here. We're going to have um, greenery and a bow. I already made the bow. Where's my bow? My bow is here. Okay, so like I said, it doesn't scream Easter. I do have little bunny ribbon in it and I put a little bling bling because you know how I like my bling bling in my bows so that's already made because I didn't know if I'd have enough time to do everything so I'm just gonna cut these hey Shirley yes my family is doing well I appreciate you asking I hope everyone else is doing well Ooh, that's a thickums is there a tag on here let's cut this tag off thank you Joanne I appreciate that Roxanne! How are you, girl? Alright, so we're going to cut a few of those. Okay. I might have to cut them a little shorter, but I think we're going to be okay. Let's go a little shorter. Now, these are thick. I actually should get my stem cutter out, but of course, I'm lazy. So, Doodles, will you do me a favor and let me know when it's 5 to 1, 5 minutes, because we have to stay to a strict schedule today. And we all know that, you know, I I like to talk. I could be on forever. Hey, Christina, how are you guys? Thank you so much for spreading the love, guys. All right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to take these. Let me just look. I'm going to go a little shorter, not much. I'm going to go a little, little bit shorter. All right. Oh, God. Oh. Hey Samantha, I don't think, I don't think mine posted, so hey, from Bama and Sprinkle, thank you, Samantha, I appreciate you spreading the love for me, and listen, I would appreciate it, you guys, if you spread the love when you watch any of our lives today, because it helps them grow their pages, my clubbies, and it also helps the community, you know, every time you spread the love for someone on their page, it helps grow this fabulous community. All right, so this is how we're going to do it. I'm going to bring this up in here, and this is what we're going to have, all right? And I'm just going to hold it in my hands. Um, I'm going to grab some of this, which is eucalyptus. We're going to mix our greenery, okay, as I throw stuff on the floor. Oops, why are we not scrolling? What's going on here? Hey, Lynn, how are you? Hey, Becky Jones. Becky, would you mind putting, um, spreading the love for me? Because I didn't do that like I typically do. I would appreciate it, girl. I usually do it to all my groups and everything, and I just didn't want to waste time because I knew I wanted to get this design done and hang out with you guys. All right. So today in New York, as you can see, it is gorgeous. The sun is out, and I'm just laying these in my hand just on top. And once I get them attached to the grapevine, we can just fluff them and pull them out and put them where we want them. Okay. Um, yeah, so it's gorgeous in New York. The sun is out, but tomorrow's going to be miserable. It's going to be raining. So I, I have my door open. Windows are open in the house. 
loving it right now. Loving it. So as you see, I save these. I don't throw these out. These make, um, I use them for multiple things. For my glue pot, I use them for the um, gaps and cracks. Um, I use them for a lot of things. Last night, my clubby said that I, don't, I hold on to everything. Sweet Connie McCormick from Reads by Connie M told me that I don't throw anything out. I was like, girl, I do so. What are you saying? She's like, girl, you hold on to everything. I was like, you're kind of right. I do. <laughs> Thank you for spreading the love. I appreciate it, guys. You guys are awesome. Susan, you have rain all day there. All right, let's add some ficus. I grabbed some ficus. So you see how I'm mixing different greeneries, which is awesome. Okay. We're going to add some ficus in here. Take the tag off first. Okay, and I'm just going to stick it right down in here, right down the middle. So I was going to do a regular mesh wreath for you guys, but I said since it's the marathon, you know, we got to step our game up a little. You know, i got to show you what we do in the clubhouse kind of thing. So we are, I'm giving you a little sneak peek of some of the kind of things we do, grapevines, and how I design my items. All right, so I hold it all in my hand just like that, kind of like a swag, you see? So then I'll take a zip tie, okay, you know what, I gotta be able to see the clock, all right, and I'm just gonna take the zip tie, and I'm just gonna go right in the middle of where I'm holding it, where my hand is, and we're gonna attach that zip tie. Now, a lot of these lives that you're gonna see, not everyone's gonna be, you know, teaching, or not that I'm teaching, but I'm just showing you how, what we do and how I do it in the clubhouse, all right. But some of them, you just might be hearing them chit-chat with you and, and design at the same time. We're going to put one more in there. Okay, I'm going to put two to hold that. Okay. Connie, you're live at two. Yeah, go check the schedule out. You'll see when your favorite designer is coming on this afternoon. You will see it. You guys, thank you so much for spreading the love. We're going to give away um, some happy mail. Hold on. In just one second, I'm going to get this attached. So spread the love, guys. Tell everyone there is a clubby marathon. Katie's Clubhouse, my private group, and my members have decided to do a marathon for everyone who is home, who is bored out of their mind, who their children are nagging them. All right, so we have our swag on. I'm just going to clip these off. Lower it. There we go. One went overboard. And there we go. Okay. All right, so that's what we have. And I'm just going to add it right here, okay? Don't worry that it's all straight. We're going to bend it, and we're going to fluff it, and it's going to look beautiful, all right? All right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to come down through here. Now, the nubby, and I tell my clubbies all the time, your nubby of your zip tie should be up, not on the bottom. You don't want anything scratching your customer's door, okay? So you want to come, keep the nubby up. Come right on up through here. Hey, Marion, thank you for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Thank you, Shirley. This sign is available in my shop at crazymazycreation.com. You can see it right there on my doodle caddy. Okay. And we're going to zip tie this right in and pull that nice and tight. And we're going to zip tie one more time. Kathy Kirkland, how are you, girl? Kathy Kirkland is one of our designers today. Uh, she on today? I don't know. Let's see. Kathy Kirkland, she's the one that makes all those doll embellishments. No, she's tomorrow at 3 p.m. And uh, I just made the bumblebee wreath. If you guys caught my live the other night, um, I have gotten a great response from that wreath. And she has gotten a great response on her bumblebee. Um, she has come out with baby cow and baby pig. And my patriotic girl that I made in my private group that I posted the picture. She made that girl as well. All right. Hey, Shara, how are you? I'm so looking forward to watching everyone. I'm starting with the marathon. I can't wait. Yes, Margaret. Thank you for your support. We appreciate it. You know, and it helps others. You know, um, if you put a red bow, I made some red bows. I'm going to give them to my neighbors today. Um, that's another way of helping your community. All right, so look what we have. We have it on, right, so far. So if you want to start, we can just start bending and fluffing and just... Put your greenery where you want it. So this is all wired. All right. 
and just intermingle. I like to intermingle my eucalyptus and my ficus all together. So when you see things out in nature, you know, everything is not just, you know, laying flat. You want things to come off your grapevine. You want it to be dimensional. I talk about dimension and everything in my group. Um, you want them not like that. You want them fluff like that. You see the difference of how we have them? I'm going to step back because it's going to be a nice big piece. Okay? Whoopsie. Then slowly getting supplies. Hey, Gloria. Hey, Christy White. How are you, girl? Got to go back. Ribbon got unwired and said, yes, you need wired ribbon. That's all I use. Wired ribbon is, for me, the jam. Okay? Um, I don't use anything but wired ribbon. Um, I do have, like, maybe a few non-wired, and I use them as accents um, sometimes. All right. So that's what we have. Look how great it's coming together already. All right. These are, like, simple simple projects that you can do. All right. So let's add our bow in. Here's our bow. Okay. All right. I'm going to add our bow in. We're going to go this way. Right down through the grapevine. And we're going to cover all the zip ties. That's what our bow is going to do. Okay. Covering all the zip ties. Hey, Sharon, how are you? Oh, thank you, girl. I appreciate it. It is going to be an awesome day. You guys, there are so many designers in this community, um, not just the members of my private group, but there's a lot doing their part to um, help with what's going on in the world right now, take people's minds off of it, just to help get through our days. And like I said earlier, one of my members, Tom Hutton from Tweety Tom's Creation, he's going to be live also, I believe, today. What time is he live? Um, Tom is live at 4 p.m. Eastern. Now, all the times are Eastern. Um, it was his idea during one of, um, last week, during Fun Day, Bow Sunday, which is one of our days to go live in my private group. Hey, Linda, how are you? Thank you so much, guys, for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Um, it was his idea. He's like, Katie, what can we do for the community? Let's do, like, something where we go live all the time and just keep their minds off of all the ugliness in the world. Um, and I was like, Absolutely. So I put a post up that day, or that evening, I should say. And um, so I put all my pipe cleaners. If you see, I tuck it back inside. I don't want anything scratching my customer's door. So everything gets tucked inside the grapevine. All right, so this is what we have so far. So far, really cute, right, guys? So we're going to fluff our tails. We can add more rib ribbon tails if we want towards the end or as we put them in. Um... So Tom was like, yeah, can we do something? I was like, absolutely. I will facilitate it. I will get it going. And this is what we came up with, doing a live like this. I might put a little bit. Now, if anyone knows me when I design, I kind of like design as I go. You know what I mean? It's like one of those things. I don't really, I come up with a concept and I design as I go. That's basically it. You know, so I'm kind of feeling I want a little raffia in this as well. Thank you guys so much. Let's give something away real fast because I don't want to waste time doing happy mail. But you know Doodles and I, we got to give away happy mail, right? So who wants happy mail? Let me hear you. Let me hear who wants happy mail. Let me see some hearts, guys. Uh, what is today? Today is Friday, Marathon Day. Super excited. Who are we going to give happy mail to? You have challenged yourself so friendly. Can you really only keep... Alive. I don't know, but we're going to try. I have tried. I've tried to prep as much as I could before this live. So I'm hoping, Roxanne, I can keep it to an hour. Susan Galley. Is that right? Susan Galley, send me your mailing address. You just got yourself some happy mail, girl. All you have to do is be on this live. You have to spread the love, enjoy yourself, and engage. Talk to each other, make friends, and that's all you have to do. All right, let's 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 put a little uh, some flowers in here, shall we? I got some uh, white cabbage roses, and I got some something. I don't know what these are. Some cute little, pretty little yellow thing with flower jobber nava covers. All right, so my doodles is checking the time. How much time do we have, honey? We have about 42 minutes. 
Are you kidding me? It's 12.18. Holy, that 20 minutes went by already? It's 12.19. Oh my God. See, this is why I can't be put on a timer. You can't put a timer on. How am I going to do it? Crafters Convention. Crafters Convention, you have an hour to present. Um, that's crazy talk. I think it's an hour. Oh my God, I got to start practicing for like an hour. Oh my God, how's that ever going to happen? All right. So, I have so much to say and do. I don't even know what I'm saying or doing. Hey, Trish, how are you, girl? Now, the normal person can just easily talk and be calm and just do their thing and be done in an hour. Nope, not me. Because I don't. I don't work like that, you know? It's crazy. So I don't like these greeneries. They look fake and cheap to me. So I'm just going to take them off. We have enough greenery on here that will, um, you won't even notice that they're missing. I know, those yellow ones. Thanks, Maggie. Maggie says it's uh, 1220. My clubbies are right there to show me love. Oops, the head of this came off. Would you pay attention? Katie, and put it back on. All right. Maggie said good practice for a crafters convention. It is good practice. Yes. So if you guys gotten your tickets for crafters convention, because I am going to be a presenter there. So is my girl Melissa from Burlap Boutique. She's going to be a presenter for business day. All right, let's get some of these in. Um, super nervous because I've never been a presenter before. Now, I've been on stage before. Um, with other women, but never by myself. I've never been a presenter by myself. Um, so this definitely will be a first for me. Um, and I'm super, super excited. Super nervous. But I know with all of you being there and supporting me, I'm going to get through it. I'm going to be sweating and nervous, and I won't know what to say or do, but... I'll figure it out. And plus, having Melissa with me, being another presenter, I'm going to be okay. So we're just adding some of these um, cabbage roses in here, okay? And I'm bending them. So you see what they look like so far? We're just going to add them sporadically throughout, okay? Okay. So how many of you, let me see hearts, if you love a grapevine wreath, let me see. Thumbs up if you prefer um, a mesh wreath. Let me hear what you prefer. Do you prefer grapevine or do you prefer hearts if you like grapevine? Thumbs up if you like a deco mesh wreath. Okay. I want, I'm just curious to see what you guys prefer in your design aesthetic. Hey, Johnny. How are you? Johnny's another one of our designers. From, um, oh my God, I just lost the name of it. Creative Designs by JL. Oh my God, for a moment I was like, wait, I know her, her name. All right, let's get a few more of these cut because I'm loving them. Hey, Kathleen, how are you? Thank you so much for spreading the love, guys. You like both. Wow, we've seen a, a lot of thumbs up, a lot of more deco mesh than grapevine. Uh, A lot of thumbs. I'm so surprised. I would have thought people liked the farmhouse look of the grapevine. Wow. I like them both. Depends on my mood. Oh, I like that, Melinda. I like them both. Don, I like them both either. A lot of thumbs up. I'm really, honestly, I'm so surprised. I really thought grapevine people were going to say um, that they kind of like a little more. Hey, Lois. How are you, girl? You like them both. Can't decide. Hey, Tia. How are you? All right, so let's get some more of these cabbage roses in there. All right, so when I decided what I was doing, um, which was this morning, um, you know, because I don't plan. Honestly, I don't plan. The only time I plan is for my private group. You know, when I come live with you guys, I honestly, I don't, I don't do much planning. You know, so I came up with the concept. You know, and my mom was like, you're doing grapevine on a live? And I was like, um, yeah. She's like, you know, you can only be on for an hour. I was like, I know, I can do it, mom. You know, sometimes you just have to step outside your comfort zone, you know, and just do things that you typically would not do. And I said, you know what? I'm going for it. I am going for it. Let's put some back here. 
And now when I add my glue, I put a nice amount of glue on my on my um, stem. Don't be chintzy. I always tell that to my clubbies. Don't be chintzy with your glue, okay? Invest in some really good glue. I use Attec glue. I've been using it since I joined Nick Credicos's uh, group. Um, and I love it, personally. Um, I've never had a problem with it. So, I get it off Amazon. I have, um, if you guys don't know, on Crazy Maze Creations, at the pin post at the top of my page, I do have um, a list of all my favorite um, things and groups that I belong to. So if there's ever anything you're like, oh, where'd you get this? Where'd you get that? M most, I would say 95% of everything I use in the clubhouse is on that list. And if there ever is anything not on there, you can always just reach out to me and ask me. Okay. So we're all, we're coming together, guys. I'm kind of loving this. We're going to put a little bit of that those yellows in there. I'm going to come right under here on the outside under this bow and put a rose right there. And remember to bend your roses, you know, because like I said earlier, nothing grows straight in the wild. All right, there we have it. Isn't that looking great? Am I holding it straight? I'm not. There we go. Isn't that looking good? Let's put some yellow in there. All right, how are we doing on time? How are we doing? Hey, Elizabeth. How are you? Uh, oh, thanks, Becky. Thanks for supporting us. We appreciate it. I love this community so much, and all my clubbies do as well. I mean, it's our way of giving back to the community and to, you know, everyone going through what they're going through in this world, you know, right now. We're all going through a tough time, you know, so we're going to be here for the next eight hours just taking your mind off things. Yes, if you're interested in joining my private group, it is uh, posted in the link. Okay, and I'm just going to come right under here. And again, you don't want things laying flat, so move them around. I want it to look like, you know, Mother Nature put it there, not us. Okay. So we're going to add just a bit of that yellow in here. Just to give it another. Yellow and orange are a great complement to each other. If you put orange and yellow and green together, they're a great complement, guys. Okay. So this is available in my shop, this wreath. Um, if you go to Crazy Maisie creation.com right there on my doodle caddy I'm just pushing these stems up so I can get a more of a stem um, this is available you'll see a Facebook picture it will say made live on a Facebook page with today's date okay and this could go out this weekend to you guys and could be hanging on your door by Monday or Tuesday ready for the Easter holiday season okay that yellow is just the right punch that we needed in here Sue Merrick, she's another member that is going to be going live um, in, the marath in the marathon. She's from Merrick Memories. I believe she goes live tomorrow night. I don't remember. It's on the schedule. So definitely go check out that schedule. Some of your favorite designers may be on there. That will be going live this weekend. Come on, sucker. Let's get in there. There we go. Okay. I'm just mixing them up. There we go. All right. I'm going to put a few on the outside. Because don't forget the outside. Remember, when someone walks up to your door, you have people that are all different heights and sizes. So someone 6'4 is going to look at your wreath different than someone 5'3. Okay? So when you're designing, guys, remember, just don't do the front of it. You know, you have to do the sides of your wreaths, the inside of your wreath, you know, the outside, you know, depending on what you're designing. Um, so think of that when think of everything when you're designing you got to think of everyone and everything okay okay and we're gonna put one right under the bow squeeze me scissors I need my there we go yes oh awesome thank you so much for spreading the love guys I'm so excited let's give some happy mail away should we I think we should right how much time do I have does anyone have a time check for me Time check. So I'm putting some right under the bow here, right in front of this greenery. All right. 
So this is what we have towards the bottom. I think that yellow really pops. I think it really pops off that wreath. All right, let's cut up another one. Awesome. There we go. What's the time? 12, 20. Oh my God, Bonnie Burns. So I have a half hour. I think I can do it. So right after me is Paula Schneider. Schneider. Shiner? Shiner. I, I, I'm not good with names, guys, or how to pronounce them. Um, she is a fabulous designer in my private design group. Um, she did, if you look at her page, if you go to P-S-E-N Creations, she did a beautiful autism wreath this week. And honestly, it knocked my socks off. It is gorgeous. Um, so definitely go check her out. Okay. Um, she's going to be live at 1 o'clock right when I get off. So when I get off, you're going to go to her page. All right. Everyone was like, where do we find the lives? Because everyone's thinking it's going to be on my page. No, we're spreading the love all over the place. So all my clubbies, well, not all my clubbies, but who's ever um, is involved in the marathon, they are all doing their lives. Whoopsies. They're all doing their lives on their own pages, which is fabulous. So you guys will get to know some new fabulous designers that you may not have seen before or heard of before. Two of my designers that are going live, I think one's going live today, one's going live tomorrow. Um, remember these names. Ashley is one. And Joanne is the other. They have never done a live before, guys. They're doing their first live on the marathon. Oh, uh, my God. What a way to kick off your first live, right? So I think they're rock stars for even volunteering. I think it's great. They're going to do awesome. And I'm super excited for them. Super excited for them. I'm sure they're probably nervous as all get out. And uh, they're going to be rock stars. I just know it. I know they're going to do awesome. So please, when you see either Joanne, Joanne's name of hers, hold on, I have it written right here, from JoJo's Rustic Remnants, okay? When you see her go live, she's going live tomorrow at 8 o'clock. And when you see Ashley, she'll be live today at 3 o'clock. Ashley is from Cleveland's Crafty Creations. When you see her go live today, show her some grace. Give her some love and tell her she's doing fabulous on her first live ever. Okay? I'm so excited for them. Yes, right, Susan? Hey, Sanchez. First time here. Do you create your signs? Yes, this is one of my signs. It's in my shop at crazymazycreations.com. I have a whole mess of signs behind me that I've created. You can just go check out my website and see um, all the goodies that I make. I have kits in there. I have supplies in there. I have um, uh, wreaths in there. I have signs in there. I have, a, I have everything and anything you're looking for in there. Because I just love everything when it comes to crypt. This is turning out fabulous, guys. I am loving this. Loving this. Um, yes, it is a creative marathon. Hey, Venus, how are you? You guys spread the love. Let's give away something. Let's, let, let's do some happy mail. Where's my pen? I just feel it. I have an urge. I have an urge. Um, here we go. Happy mail. So all you have to do to receive happy mail is three things. Have a good time. Engage. Chit chat. Network with them. Make new friends. And spread the love. Those are the only three, three, only three things that are required of you when you're on my lives. No matter where I am. To get some happy mail. Val Smith, Val Smith, send me your mailing address. I am sending you out some happy mail, girl. Yes, I am. I need a sip of water. Yes. All right. I'm sorry I'm not saying hello to all of you, but I am on the clock. So I have to um, just focus. Just focus. Just focus. All right. So I'm coming on the outside here. And I'm going to put some more of this green, yellow florals on the outside. Look how this is coming out. i got to put a little on the inside. Got two more pieces. Hey, Michelle. Thank you, Michelle. I appreciate that. Hey, Mama. Hi. Are you a little chilly with the door open? Yeah. I like that sweater on you. Oh, thank you. Can you all see my mom? They can see you. Oh, God. <laughs> my mama just loves the camera, man. She loves the camera. Not so much. Not so much. Every time someone says, oh, I can see your mom. She's so cute. You know, she's like, oh, God, I'm on live. And I was like, yeah, you're a movie star. 
Follow the designs. I've worked very hard to put the marathon on for everyone. You guys, please. Yes, Amanda, absolutely. Hey, Janet, how are you? We're doing good, Sandra. Yes. So, my members of Katie's Clubhouse, we are called Clubbies. Okay? So, that's why the marathon is called Clubby Live Marathon, because they are all Clubby members in my group. Okay? And they all want to do something for everyone that is home, that may be bored out of their minds, a TV. There's nothing new on TV. You know? So, what are they going to do? They want to, you know, surf the internet. So, we're here just to inspire, get your creative juices going, and just to entertain you. All right, you know what we're gonna do real fast? How much time do I have, guys? We're gonna add some ribbon, some ribbon tails, all right? So real fast, I'm gonna grab some orange. Some orange and some of the green. Does anyone have a time check for me? Do you feel like you're on a treadmill? <laughs> Bonnie Burns. Yeah, because I don't design like this. This is not my M.O. I, you know me, guys. I like to chit-chat, hang out with you guys, and, you know, have some fun. So this being restricted to an hour. And I told all my clubbies last night, I was like, make sure you're on time. Make sure you are you keep track. You're an hour. You know, because we got eight designers going today, eight designers going tomorrow. You know, we got to have a nice flow. So please try and, you know, be on time. And so, you know, if I tell them to do that, you know, I've got to do that. All right, so let's cut this. All right, so we're going to do, how much time do I have? 25 minutes. All right. So I'm going to get my, oh, geez, my pick machine, if I can. Oh, God, that is heavy. All right, so if you don't have a pick machine, guys, you could use um, a greenery pick from Michael's or anything. You could use a Chinese chopstick, a skewer to do what I'm doing and just wrap it with wire. Okay, all I'm gonna do is fold this, scrunch it, take my pick machine, and I'm gonna put a pick on it. All right, nice simple way. If you don't, like I said, if you don't have a pick machine, use a chopstick that you get from your Chinese, um, Chinese food, all right? All right, so this has a pick, as you can see, just like that, okay? I'm gonna put a nice chunk of glue and I'm gonna come right here under the bow and I'm gonna stick it right under the bow, guys. Right under that bow, okay? All right, and we're gonna have, now we have tails, okay? So we're gonna scrunch our tails, or maybe I won't scrunch, I'm just gonna do loops. Yeah, maybe we'll do loops. Let's get some pipe cleaners. So these are just little tips and tricks that I show my design group that I'm showing you today. We're gonna to take a pipe cleaner, okay? I'm gonna scrunch this. Doing great on time, thank you. Okay, we're gonna go right down through the grapevine. Okay. Go right down through the grapevine on both sides. Come on, grapevine, work with me. Come on, grapevine, there we go. And we're just gonna twist twist, twist a few times, tuck it under, cut it off without cutting my fingers, there we go, okay, we're going to do the next one, okay, let's do this one, now I'll put them at different, different, um, there we go, just like that, we're going to pinch, get our pipe cleaner, twist it around, hey Kathy, how are you? Hey, Jackie. Okay, we're gonna do the same exact thing. We're gonna just move your greenery over. Okay, and find a little area. And we're gonna go right down through the, right down through the grapevine again. Okay. And we're gonna twist. Hey, Gloria. Another toy to buy. Now, honestly, guys, if you don't have the money in your budget, to buy a pick machine, you don't buy. They can be expensive, all right? You can use, like I said, a chopstick from your Chinese food. Um, I used to use dowels. And what you do is, real fast, I'll show you. You would take your, you know, scrunch it, okay? Use a dowel, take some wire, wrap it around, and use the dowel, stick it in the grapevine. You don't need to go buy expensive tools. That's what I tell my clubbies also. Um, did I chop it off? Uh, yeah, I gotta twist it and stick it back up in there. So you don't have to um, 
have all these expensive gadgets. I've been doing this for a long time, and through the years, I have gathered all these um, tools, okay? So I know it gets daunting that all these people have these fabulous tools, and you may be just starting out, or it's not in your budget. Don't feel like you need them. All right, we're just gonna curl the ends. Okay, I'm just curling the ends, and I'm just gonna let them flow nice, nicely down. Okay, nice loosey goosey. Okay, we're gonna do the other one. Okay, how much time do I have? I feel like the clock is like ticking. Doodles, you're supposed to be tell, telling me time checks. It's 12.39. 12.39, I have 20 minutes. I think I can do it. I know, but I kind of lied. I, I kind of need more. All right, so that's where we have our ribbon tails up there. We're going to do the other side now. Now, we had the green on the outside, orange on the inside. We're going to go opposite now, okay? We're going to do the same exact thing, but opposite. And again, you saw me. I didn't measure. I just kind of eyeballed it. That's usually how I design. When I'm here in my clubhouse by myself designing, even in on a public live, I tell you guys, don't get caught up in measurements. Don't get caught up in... You know, Katie, how long did you cut that? Katie, how long is it? It doesn't matter. Honestly, it does not matter if you cut it 10 inches, 12 inches. It does not affect your design. All right, so I'm putting orange on the outside this time. We're going to scrunch. Thank you so much for spreading the love, guys. I really, really appreciate it. And so do my clubbies. I know all of them are super, super excited to do this for you guys today. And it's going to be a fun fun day and I'm so happy I could kick it off all right so again we have our pick all right I'm just gonna dip it in the glue put a nice amount of glue on it remember don't be don't be chintzy with your glue we're gonna go back up on the opposite side now underneath that bow we're gonna get it right up in there there we go saw a crafter last night the bow was beautiful Okay. I put a little jewel in the bow because I just wanted to add a little bling, bling, bling. All right, so we're going to do the same exact thing. So you just measure, see how long you want your poofs, okay? And I'm going to go right about there. Grab two more pipe cleaners. You can use zip ties if you choose, like, using zip ties, but pipe cleaners work for me. Or if you're fancy, you call them chenilles, chenille stems. I'm not. I'm old school. Thank you, Becky. Spread the love, guys. Hashtag spread love. Did you guys see my new t-shirt that's in my shop? Well, it will be in my shop. I haven't gotten it in there yet. But I have spread the love t-shirts that are coming with Maisie's face on them. Now, it doesn't say Crazy Maisie Creation. It has My business is nowhere on there. So, actually, Maisie could be any Yorkie. But, um, so where the L, the L-O-V is, English, English, Kathleen, English. Where the L-O-V-E is, that's hard to say. Um, Maisie's face is the O and there's a little wreath around her head so stinking cute guys I can't even take it okay why are you giving me a hard time can we just go through the grapevine like a normal pipe cleaner sometimes you have to talk to your materials do you ever talk to your supplies I know I do every now and then all right let's get down in there hey Tanya how are ya oh we're freezing try and go out and come back in it could be Facebook. Mine's working fine here. Hey, Teeny. How are you, girl? Teeny, Teeny. Bobini, Teeny. Teeny. How are you, girl? I don't know. I just feel like singing. I'm so excited for today. Hey, Nicole. Your wreath is absolutely beautiful. Thank you, girl. I couldn't finish your whole comment, but I appreciate that. This wreath is in my shop right now. You will see a Facebook picture. Say made on a Facebook Live, and it is in my shop for whoever wants to purchase it. Doodles is here, ready to ship it. It could go out today. So if you want it on your door by Monday or Tuesday, it could be there, guys, for Easter. All right. And because we're doing a marathon, I really, I priced it really, really inexpensively, honestly, um, with everything that I've added in it. So it is up steel, the price, in my shop. So if you are interested in this wreath, it is available right now. Just go to crazymazycreation.com. And it can be yours. All right, so just move your greenery out of the way. And let's put it in there. Thank you, Sandy. I appreciate that. Hey, Connie McManus from Kentucky. How are you, girl? Oop, I just smacked myself with greenery. 
Okay, come on. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Do you know Maisie hasn't even been on the live? That's how fast I've been working. I didn't even get my Maisie girl on this live. Surprise, Kathy Kirkland or Tom Tom hasn't said anything to me about it. Holy mackerel. I can't even with myself. They're having a troll. <laughs> right? Okay. Can't believe Maisie didn't run down here once you heard me say, Hey guys, how are you? All right. Okay, let's curl these. She went back upstairs? I think so. Oh, okay. So we're just going to curl these. Oh, I think I'm in good timing, guys. 15 minutes, Becky. 15? Oh my God, this is cake. I can make another wreath. <laughs> let's not push it. <laughs> yeah, right? 15 minutes? Shoot. I got this. I'm going to be, it's going to be cake at Crafters Convention. An hour. I'm going to dare Scott to give me, give me a half hour. I can make a design. <laughs> and you're like, let's, let's do it. So you guys, you have to go to craftersconvention.com to get your tickets. I'm telling you, it's going to be a riot. Like I said, there's going to be fabulous designers. There. Jace is going to be there. Trenton's going to be there. Um, I'm going to be there. There's so many. Um, Candy's going to be there. Uh, Damon Oates, of course, is going to be there. Becky's going to be there. Uh, there's so many fabulous designers. Terry Marshall's going to be there. Oh, my God. It, the lineup is crazy. And I'm telling you, I went this year, and the hotel, the convention center is all in one. It's beautiful. They just redid it. It was one of the best times I've ever had at a convention this year at, at um, Crafters Convention. Honestly, I'm telling you the God's honest truth. We had a ball. We had a ball. Guys, this came out stinking Cute. Let me just tell you. Stinking cute. Paula. Paula is up next. You guys see her? She's on here from PSEN. She's one of my clubbies. She is the next designer at 1 o'clock. She's going to rock it. I don't know what she's doing for you guys, but I know it's going to be fabulous. Go check out her shop. She just did an autism um, wreath. I'm telling you, it knocks your socks off. All right. I'm just going to add a little more greenery. I just want to add a little more greenery in here. Do, 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 do. A little boxwood I want to add. Okay. So we're going to cut these in clusters. Oh, there's the Maisie girl. She'll, she'll come on when we're saying goodbye. All right. I'm just going to add a few of these. These are from Walmart. They're one of my faves. They're 97 cents. I'm going to go for a walk. Then. Okay. Thank you, Becky. Yes, PSEN Creations up next. Paula. So as soon as I get off at 1, you guys head on over to PSEN, and she will be the next designer. And then after her, she'll announce to, and tell you who the next designer after her is. Yeah, we're going to add some of that. That gives. See, what I like about this, it gives a little dark and a little light green. So I'm all about texture and dimension in my designs. I try and preach that to my clubbies as well. Um, you don't want your design to be flat and not just laying flat. I mean, just looking flat, you know, you want dimension, you want texture in your designs. Okay. So try and put in as much as you can, because I think it's great for the eyeball. It keeps your eye moving and that's what you want. You want to have eye movement. You don't want someone just looking at your design straight on. You want them to look everywhere. You want them to be like, holy cow, that is gorgeous. You know? <laughs> that's my go-to Amanda you know that I love a good boxwood so there's two that I love this one from Walmart I love this boxwood and I have one of my faves from um, I'm gonna go on the inside um, one of my faves from Hoblobs that I do enjoy using um, they're my two favorites boxwoods to use okay there go one more play with ribbon all day. I just want to tuck it up out of my way until I'm done sticking these in. I'm going to put a few right here under the yellow. 
Hey, Kim, how are you? Ten minutes. Thank you, Shirley. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think I got it. I think I can take it from here. I think I can rock it. But let me tell you, it was like a workout just now. It was definitely like a workout, this me doing something within... Um, within an hour. <laughs> I don't design this fast. But hey, it's good, right? You should always step out of your comfort zone. I'm always up for a challenge. Always. A little bling bling there. Whoops. Now I'm going to stick a few pieces. I'm going to break this one down a little. I'm going to put a few in my bow here. Uh, Dee Dee, thank you, girl. Okay, we're going to break this in actually two, three spots. So I'm going to break it down even more. Okay. So we're going to add some greenery right into our bow. Okay. Where's the other piece right here? Okay. So I want to, I want this bow to feel like it is part of the greenery family. I want it like it's just sitting in a patch of greenery. So this might be one of the designs that I don't use my perfect tails. So let me see some hearts if you guys know what perfect tails are. Do you all know what perfect tails are? Come on. If you guys know what the perfect tails are, I want to see some hearts for them. Per I always use perfect tails, but not in this design. No perfect tails required. Perfect tails are measuring ribbon boards that I use in almost every one of my designs. Except for today. This is screaming greenery. And I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, let's break this one down. Okay, time check. Thank you, Kathleen. I appreciate it. <laughs> you will need a monitor tomorrow. <laughs> I'll be there to, to be there for you, girl. I'm going to try and be on everyone's live. I'm going to work down here while listening and participating in everyone's live today. You saw bald people. You did? Yeah. And there's the May May. May May, did I go live without you? Did I go live without you, May May? Say hi to everyone. We're on the Clubby Live Marathon and we're kicking it off. Well, actually, you're ending it right now, but we're kicking it off. It's the first one today. Right? Say hi. Should we give away some happy mail? Let's give away happy mail. All right? Let's give away happy mail. You go down there and you guys spread the love. I'm going to give you one minute to spread the love what I do with that piece I cut and I'm gonna give away some happy mail all right as I finish up on this design that I am in love with I think that came out gorgeous all right so guys if you're interested in joining my private design group it's called Katie's Clubhouse the link to PayPal is, we go live twice a week. The link to PayPal is in the comments. Um, we go live every Sunday for Fun Day Bow Sunday and every Tuesday at 7 p.m. Um, and we have one live Zoom call a month, our family clubby Zoom call. And uh, what else? This hot, we have two Zoom calls this year, uh, this year, this month, because we're doing a Unique in the Creek kit. And Connie from Reads by Connie M, she's actually going to um, show us, because I've never done a Unique in the Creek board. She is going to show us, because she is the... Miss Guru of Unique in the Creek. And she's going to show us how to do the sunflower kit. So we all bought the sunflower kit and we're going to do it on a Zoom call in the clubhouse. So it's going to be a good, good time. Time check, babe. 12.53. Ooh, seven minutes. I got this. All right, guys. I think we are done. What do we think? 
Can it fit in the screen? Or should I stand it up? Oh my God, it is so stinking cute. So cute. It's good. Thanks, babe. I appreciate that. I just want one or two more pieces down at the bottom. And I might put a rose down there as well. All right. Also, guys, don't forget, go to Three Gals Boutique. That is where me, Doreen, and Melissa, we have all our apparel in there. All right? So if you go to Three Gals Boutique, that pink shirt that I was wearing the other day, it's in there. And Doreen is constantly adding new apparel in there all the time. So go check out Three Gals Boutique. We're going to be adding a lot of fun stuff in there. In the upcoming with fall coming up and everything. All right. I think we're done. I am loving this. I think it came out fabulous. All right, guys. Let me hold it up and show you. Oh, I left that on there. There we go. Look how cute. Cute, cute, cute. Curl. I need you to curl for me. There you go. There. All right. So that's it. That's available in my shop, guys. You'll see it with a Facebook Live picture on it. Okay? It will say Facebook Live made with today's date um, on a Facebook Live. Oh, my God. That was so exciting. What time is it? Can we? Do we have time to give away one more thing of Happy Mail? We always have time. Okay, so 1 o'clock, Paula from PSEN Creations is going live. Definitely check her out. The schedule for today um, for the lives are posted in Crazy Amazing Creation. Go check it out. It's also posted in the community page. I blasted it everywhere. So did my clubby. So you'll find it. All right. Um, it's a two-day event. We will start again tomorrow at noontime. I will kick it off again tomorrow. And you will have all my clubbies today. You will have... Paula today from PSEN Creations. After that, after that is Connie McCormick from Reach by Connie. At 3 o'clock, you have Ashley from Cle Cleveland's Crafty Creations. 4 o'clock, you have Tom from Tweety Tom's Creations. 5, Billy from Billy Ann's Creations. 6, Heather from Heather's Homespun Hobbies. And at 7 p.m., you have Sue Merrick closing it out for the day. So that is the lineup for today. Definitely check it out. Spread the love for everyone. Let's give away a little happy mail before we end. What's the time check? I got four minutes. I am talking like like I'm high on something. I have no idea. I am talking like Speedy Gonzalez right now. Holy macaronis. Um, so funny. Brandy. Brandy. Strubble. Sua, Suara? I don't know how to say your last name. But Brandy. Send me. Your mailing address, Strumble. Am I saying that right? Surara. I don't know how to say your last name. I'm sorry, I'm messing up your last name. But send me your address and I will send you some happy mail, girl. Yes, I will. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so excited for today. I'm so happy we could be here to brighten up your day, to inspire, to just fill your heart with some love. And how much time do I have? Oh, I have three minutes. I can kick back and relax right about now. Mm -hmm. Chug your water. I could breathe. <laughs> Holy mackerel. All right, guys. That was probably the fastest I've ever talked on a live in my life. I don't think I've ever gone that fast in my life. <laughs> it, was good, though. You did it. it was good. I did it. I'm so excited. Yes. Uh, P uh, Paula from PSEN Creations is up next, guys. So please show her some love. She's fabulous. She really is great. Venus, on to the next designer. Yes. All right, guys. I hope you have a fabulous, fabulous, fabulous Friday. All you have to do is just spread the love. Make someone's heart happy. And I will see you tomorrow. Please show all my clubbies some love today, guys. They've worked hard, and they're super excited to bring their love into your homes and fill your heart. All right? Have a great Friday, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye.